Welcome aboard. I'm Captain Jake. We're back here for this week's episode of Order of Battle World War II. We're currently playing the Burma Road campaign and the Awadi River scenario. We have nine turns left in uh, this particular scenario. We're on turn 51 of 60. So as a reminder, or to give credit where credit is due, this game was developed by the Aristocrats, is published by Southern, and is available on Steam. So, as we do each week, we start off with our primary objectives. Primary objectives, which were to capture the four primary victory points on the Awadi River, which we did. And then lastly, capture Mctila which we are now in the process of driving on. And like I say, we have nine turns to complete that. So let's go ahead and take a look at this week's map. As you can see, we currently have no units sighted. We've taken Mandalay, uh, Mayinmu. We're driving back through there. And Heading, we're not heading, we're not heading anywhere. We are driving from the west and from the north. And we know, I think we had some aircraft over it last time. There's a couple of batteries in here. So what we're going to do is let's take a look at our air forces first. All right, we get the Spitfires ready to get launched. And where's our next airfield here? We should have quite a few. So we're going to get our... I think we can only get two or three aircraft up at one time. Let's get our bombers up first. Uh, let's see here. This. Yep, only two aircraft at a time. All right. So now I guess we begin our push. Everybody's built, built is uh, fairly built up. So now well, we can take our heavy weapons unit. Well, let's take it to here. Oh, good. You can switch here. And drop a few on him. Don't know whether we have any. Probably didn't mine the railroad tracks. So, oh, he did. Naturally, he mined the railroad tracks. That's pretty stupid. Well, all right. Okay, we know we got one unit here. And, well, maybe he didn't mind the road. So let's see what we have here. Move our infantry. Put him on the road. We can move him faster. Wow. We move this guy a long ways. Oh, I want to move that guy right there. That, that far. So we come back up here, move this unit down. We have to move. Oh, that's right. Let me see. I don't remember if we had any bad guys. Don't remember from last week whether we eliminated all the bad guys.
We'll find out. All right, that's our last move. All right. On a turn 52, I do believe. Oh, that, that one hurt us. Hmm. Don't know what this was there, but they keep getting hit. not going to move any further than there so Let's see I think I can move him there and move him there all right we do have some hit that guy units in the play here. Let's go back here and get some more aircraft launched. That should be it. Yes. All right. Let's get our aviation here. All right. We'll move him to there. All right. We had infantry. How far can I use to move my comet? All right. Japanese infantry, Japanese heavy infantry. Hit, hit. That's it. I should have known that they were As they would say, shoot. Yeah, it's going to be mighty bloody. Oh, I see what it's got. Move him. Take this guy. All right, who else? Move. That's it for that turn. All right. They did have a few things hit in there. We're going to hit them, hit them hard. Come on, boys. Okay, healed up. Interesting. They healed up Vice doing anything else. So let's do this. Infantry. Looking to see. Where is it? 
See if I can get my aviation unit here. And I think this is where that unit go. Oh, that was him. Where do I go? Oh yes, 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 yes. I think thinking more aviation needed to bring in play. Uh, get these two guys launched. Who else do I have here? Oh. Let's move him there. Let's see if they just heal these guys up. can't move him anywhere so oh wait a minute it's a heavy infantry unit all right that's it okay guards are getting short here see what they're gonna do are they attacking Artillery barrage healed up. All right, that's what they did. Reinforced. All right, so let's aviation units first. left at four. Okay, that's what I wanted to see. See if we can get them. Yes. And get the flag. See if we can kill them. Oh, not quite. Oh, 
Okay, we can take this unit out. We hope. Not quite. Wanna see the boom? Yes, and we did. We should be able to see a boom here too, where some guys are dying. Yes, we did. We will move forward. Follow up. All right, let me see. Who do I have left to attack with? Oh, yes, more aviation. Alright, that is it for us. We've captured, it appears to be, now whether we need the entire town, we've gotten the two flags. So, let's hit end turn and see what happens. Alright, they're still fighting on. No, oh, no. Okay. Victory. This crushing victory is in our bid to retake central Burma from the Japanese has paved the way for advance towards Rangoon and its liberation. Well, there we go. Another victory on our pushback against the Imperial Japanese forces. Hot damn. So, let's see here. Crushing victory. Close. We'll exit. And no, we don't need to save it. Three new specialization points. Yes, we do. Always like to visit. Oh, man, we got 28 of these. Wow. I don't know what I do wrong. Like, I have to get these each time. Oh, we got the scrambling. Wired. Maybe I just look at them. And... Is there any over this way? Oh, ah, well, what do you know? Wow. I was <laughs> I wasn't paying any attention. I was going strictly down this way. Wow, all kinds over here. Special services? What is this? I don't need Hobart's funnies. Well, let's try this one. Wow. Notice slider bar. Note to south. Wow, okay. All right. What is the next one called? Race to Rangoon. No. I wasn't sure how long this uh, particular uh, campaign would go on, but it's going on. We are Rangoon of April 45. Following their recent defeats, Japanese defenses in Burma are in turmoil. Allies decide to retake the vital port Rangoon now before the monsoon season begins. Okay, so question is, should we deploy forces this time or should we just call it a short episode so that we can keep the episodes named correctly? I think we'll make this week, well, we'll just click this to start the scenario. But we won't get into it any further than probably just take a look at what kind of troops we got and what the requirements are. And once we do that, we'll probably wrap it up. It'd be a very short episode. I don't even think it's 10, 20, 20, 10, 15 minutes, maybe. All 
All right. All right, our mission briefing. Oh, look at the size of this. Red typically was the Japanese. All right, let's start the briefing. After our recent victories, the time is right to advance to Rangoon. Its major port will be needed if we are to overcome looming supply problems. In particular, the upcoming monsoon season will create a logistical catastrophe logistical catastrophe for our army. It appears the Japanese have anticipated this and are well prepared to defend the city. Yeah, I have a feeling that was going to be the case. Area reconnaissance has detected strong fortifications situated on the outskirts of Rangoon. Oh, I think we've, uh, I think ooh, I remember giving up Rangoon and retreating uh, that away. And okay. The enemy is critically support so short on supply, however. So if you can capture or destroy their supply depot, they will be strangled even further. It is equally important to guard our own supply lines and depots as they will make a tempting target for a starving enemy. Wow. 70 turns. Wow. It's a big one. The Japanese can be expected to throw every last ounce of their remaining strength into this battle. We must at all times be prepared for desperate counterattacks, as well as successive attack waves from the enemy air force. Mm, 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 mm. We have 24 air force, 60. And let's look. We got, uh, again, we got one airfield. Let's take a look at the map. We got one airfield up here by uh, Landon. And Cone. Not pretty close. No airfield there. Coming down this side. Okay, we got an airfield here. And heavy fortifications, but they're fixed. You know what we think about fixed fortifications. Uh, another airfield over here. Airfield here and airfield there. Hmm. Uh, well, that leads me to believe. Uh, may do that. We got two airfields over here which deploy here, head towards this airfield. We can capture this airfield. It shouldn't have overly strong forces. We will deploy those. So, well, let's just hit the start game here real quick. See what our objectives are. It's a uh, capture the Rangoon jail, capture Rangoon port, capture Rangoon station. Okay. And oh, here's what we have for our special land lease act, scrambling, metal detector, proximity fuse. And special services. Ah. Ah. I got it now. Should have read that section in the rules about specializations. Okay. Let's just see what where those victory locations are. Rangoon Jail, Rangoon Port.
Okay, in the Rangoon Station. Ah, all three of them <laughs> right there in Rangoon. <laughs> well, all right. But these are fixed fortifications. Can we get there? Not going that way. I think we can, but they're going to throw aviation at us, so. We're going to have to use our, our numerous aviation units that we had from last time. So, but we're going to leave that for, for next time for deployment. So, like I said, it's a short episode this week. Hope you enjoy the ending of the, the Awadi River. And we will pick up... Uh, this scenario next week i was been wasn't anything else i guess i really want to add that's the end of the, not this campaign but that's the end of uh today's uh episode it looks like it only lasts based on i'm looking at turns here about 12 minutes but I thought they would put up a bigger struggle against us. And I don't really want to get into uh, a new scenario this week. We'll go for our start of our deployments and carry on with uh, the campaign next week. So sorry it's so short this week. But as always, I'm Captain Jake, wishing you fair winds and following seas. Until next time.